Yeah, yeah. Any reason you're filming the police cars coming in and out of our gates and stuff? Yeah. Yes guys, welcome back to the channel. If you remember this scene uh, is where I got arrested, just here, up against that wall right there. Well no, go catch some real criminals then instead of lining your pocket. Don't come near me. I'm I'm going to the officer, don't come near me. Don't come I'm giving it alright. Right, give me this before it gets broken. Right. And then you come then. Alright then. Alright then. I'm not busy. Fully literally standing above that filming in there. I was literally stood behind here, leaning on this, filming, waiting for a police car to come out. And I got arrested just over there. So, we are here today to just see how they react today. Um, yeah, let's go. So they clearly know me. So just as we're walking up, we've got a uh, a story here. Um, a police officer been given a final warning. Um, discredible conduct um, has been given a second chance at this police station. Now he probably thinks he can uh, get away with anything. Misuse of confidentiality, orders and instructions, and discredible conduct has been given another chance. Uh, the name, obviously, for obvious reasons, has not been released, um, because the police won't do that, will they? They're gonna release that information, because they've gotta cover it up, you know, because he did wrong. So, I mean, just, just look, right outside the police station, all the beer. Not very good policing, is it really? In all fairness. Well, now I've briefly just seen the officer that spoke to me in the back. So I've got no qualms about somebody coming to talk to me. Um, but it is what it is. I mean, last time I was here, this vehicle here was an enforcement truck. Um, immigration enforcement, I believe it was. Boston Police Station, private car park, no public parking. I'm not a car. Neither is the 50s, hundreds of people that walk through there to cut through to the estate down here. It's what it is. And right next to the police station is an abandoned building, as you can see. Hello. Hello. There's a drone vehicle. We've probably got a nice expensive drone in there. Alright, it's parked in the driveway. Ooh, big mess up here. They're off on a call, they've probably just come back from one. Might have to park in there though. They're waiting for the gate to close. I suspect. Very busy police station for a bank holiday Monday. There you go, doors closed, these off. And I 
a couple just there walking over up the bridge now. I just parked to go into town. It's not work. It's just the police's car parked to go into town. There's a police station in it's all its glory. <laughs> and just approaching these gates is where you can see the uh, police vehicles. Just in there. All them police vehicles there. I don't think he sees me. I've got some electric vehicles back there as well. I think that's an unmarked car. She's plain clothes. She's uh, not plain clothes. She's uh, fully in uniform. He's blowing kisses. So it's about around the front now. Uh, I don't know if there's anybody in the main office, but uh, let's go have a look. So we can take a look around today. Lost and found property, found dogs. What else is a food bank? And charitable organisations locally. How to make a complaint to the Leicestershire, uh, Lincolnshire Police. Nah, just go straight to HNK solicitors. <clears throat> Ignore that. Go straight to HNK solicitors. You're right. Different languages. First place I've seen it, different languages. There are booklets. Where's the English one? Run out. Probably. Cheers, ladies. And you. There we go, they didn't try and boss me about or anything. You are here. Well, you guys ain't. I am. I'm not a job. Oh, this is a job center. This ain't a job center. It's a police station. They got that around. <laughs> well, but yeah, guys. Let's 
go back to the gate where we got arrested. Just down there. Do -do. Do -do 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 -do. So the car that's coming out now is the couple that I told you went parked in there, went shopping. He's just turned up and picked his car up just now. That's the car leaving. Free parking, I suppose. But his car's ragged, so fuck nice. So this seems to be it for Boston Police Station. I was hoping to bump into the other geezer that hopped around this corner when they arrested me. Um, it was like he was the first arrest. Ooh, let's go. That's what he did. Um, I'll put a clip in here. I'm going to the officer, don't come near me. Don't I'm going to the officer, don't come near me. And yeah, so he done that. But it's uh, nothing here at the minute. I have got to pass this by to get back to the train station. So I'll see if I can film a bit more uh, later on and see what the crack is. But for now, let's go see what's happening in Boston City Centre. Here I am again, back at Boston Police Station. Uh, I've been through the town, there's nothing going on really. Um, we have got other locations to hit up as well. Um, but yeah, guys, it is what it is, it's not very busy here. Yeah? But I'm gonna stick around for five minutes or so, because I've got five minutes before I'm gonna get a train to leave. But yeah. Oh, man. Probably the one that was watching me earlier on. That's a big wide turn. Into the middle of the road to drive in there. It's funny, isn't it? When I got arrested here, it was because I was filming this and I wasn't really filming. But now I'm openly filming and they know I'm filming, they're not doing nothing. Sergeant Trafford, you're looking worse and worse, mate. Oh, parking in there. Oh, seconds later after driving around the car park, it comes out again. Yeah, you. Is there any reason you're filming the police cars coming in and out of our gates and stuff? Yeah. Any reason? Just to let you know I've got my camera on as well, alright? Oh, good job you did that. Just out of fairness, alright. Before I start talking to you, can you identify yourself? PC661 Pudney. 661 Pudney? Yes, mate, you can see it on my shoulder, can't yeah, you? Yeah, that's fine. Alright. Thank you. Uh, just because I can legally. That's fine, mate, that's cool. Any reason you've come to ask me? Just because you're near our security gate, mate. It's a security thing. Oh, that's so. fine. Is that's that fine. all right? Yeah, that's fine. Just that, mate. I'll leave you with it. All right. Thank you. Thank you. So ask me, but I give him the answer I'm legally allowed to. And that was enough for him. I think they've learned a lesson here. So there we are, Boston Police Station learned their lesson. Um, I guess, I mean, most of them left me alone. He had an inquiry to ask, but it is what it is. Um, and on to the next one, guys, should be a banger. Peace.